Hey everybody, Michael the Tutor 16 here. Today I'm going to be doing tutorial number 34 in Microsoft PowerPoint. And the topics for discussion in this tutorial will be that I'm going to show you how to embed a fully functioning Google Map within your slideshow presentation. There is one warning. You will need to install the live web add-in on your computer so that Google Maps will work properly. I'll include the link to my tutorial on how to install the live web add-in within the description of this tutorial. The advantages of embedding a fully functioning Google Map within your presentation will be that this will give your audience or those that have access to your PowerPoint presentation the ability to use Google Maps to locate specific locations around the world. So let's go into Microsoft PowerPoint and I'm going to show you how to embed a fully functioning Google Map within your presentation. As you can see, I've gone into Microsoft PowerPoint and today I'm going to show you how to embed a fully functioning Google Map within your PowerPoint presentation. Before we begin, go up and click on your Insert tab of your Ribbon Toolbar. On the right hand side, you'll see a section in my video and this section is called LiveWeb. LiveWeb is an add-in that I've installed within my PowerPoint software and this will give me the ability to run full-fledged mapping software that I find on the internet within my presentation. You'll need to install the LiveWeb add-in to your PowerPoint software. And I've done a video or a tutorial on how to do this. And I've included a link within the description so that you can go to this tutorial and watch it. And you too can install the LiveWeb add-in to your PowerPoint software. Once you've installed the LiveWeb add-in, you can continue. So I'm going to go out to the internet and I'm going to go to Google Maps. And as you can see, I've already pulled up Google Maps on my screen. I can click and drag it around, and once I get this installed in my PowerPoint presentation, I'll be able to do all of the features that I can out here on the internet within my presentation. What you need to do is to go up to the URL where the address is and click on it to highlight it. You can then right click and copy this URL. Once you copy the URL, you can go back into your presentation. Once you're back into your presentation, Go under the Insert tab of the Ribbon Toolbar and under the Live Web section, click on the option for Web Page. When you click on this, you'll be given a box where you can right click and install that code so that you can use Google Maps. So I'm just going to do a Control Paste and I'm going to paste the link within this box. Once the link is in the box, I'm going to click on Add and you can see that it put it down in the box directly below it. Now I can just cycle through all of these options. So I'm going to click on Next. I'm going to click on Next again. And you can see the other options. It's telling me that it's going to take up 90% of my slide and it's going to be in the center of the slide itself. I'm going to click on Next again and then I'm going to click on Finish. Once I click on Finish, you'll see that I received a message that said that the information for the web pages were successfully inserted into the slide. I can click on OK and now the map has been inserted into a slide within my presentation. You won't be able to view it until you run your presentation. So to run the presentation, I'm going to go up and click on my Slideshow tab in my Ribbon Toolbar and click on From Beginning. My first slide will pop up on my screen, and when the first slide is finished, the Google Map will appear on my screen. And again, this is a fully functioning Google Map. You can click anywhere within this map and zoom in and zoom out just as you would if you were out on the internet. You can also go into the options and you can choose a different view. If you want to go to the satellite, you can click on the option for satellite and it'll take you out of the map and take you directly into the satellite view. So again, this is a fully functioning Google map that's been embedded within your PowerPoint presentation. You can get out of it just by clicking outside of the slide and your third slide should pop up on your screen and you can continue with your presentation. So this is how you embed a fully functioning Google Map within your PowerPoint presentation. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please subscribe to my YouTube channel by clicking on the subscription button located at the bottom right hand corner of your screen. If you have any questions or comments, please send them to me and I'll be more than happy to answer them. I hope you have a great day and thank you for watching.